Hey everybody, Paul here and welcome back to Best Food Review Road Trip. This is the channel where we travel all over the country, eat at different locations, and bring restaurant food reviews to you. Today we are in Portland, Oregon, and there is a super iconic location here. It's right behind me. It's called Voodoo Donuts. I'm sure you've heard of it. It's been mentioned on a ton of different shows. They only have uh, so many locations and they're only in six states, but they originated right here, right behind me at this location. Let's go check it out. We're at Voodoo Donuts, so you had to get a Voodoo doll. So this is ba your basic donut, but it's like a chocolate covered. I think it might, oh, it looks like it's filled with something, probably blood or strawberry or cherry or whatever. Let's take a bite and find out. Mmm, yeah. It's strawberry or cherry or something like that. <laughs> really good so cute here it looks like little ribs and like a poker what do you call that like the pin like the pin in the voodoo doll awesome you know the cool thing about this place is they have like tons of different designer donuts is that it designer donuts check this one out this one is called the memphis mafia and this one looks like it's got chocolate and little little chocolate chips and peanut butter and all kinds of good stuff Let's break it open. Just like that. Okay, this is so messy. And the bad thing is, is we didn't grab any napkins. Mmm. You know what Voodoo Donuts is? There's a donut shop that just throws a whole bunch of crap on top of their donuts and gives it a name. But the crap they put on there, mmm, mmm. One of the donuts that Voodoo is famous for making popular is the maple and bacon. Yes, if you've never tried a combination of maple and bacon, you probably had breakfast and poured the maple syrup on your pancake and then the maple syrup got onto your bacon and then you're like, I'm gonna eat it anyway because it's delicious. They just put it together for you because it's already good. Mmm. Mmm. Now, a maple bar has always been one of my favorites, so when you add a layer of bacon to it, it's delicious. I'm gonna try Paul's Memphis Mafia yeah. fritter. Look how giant this thing is. I mean, it's like, <laughs> it's like this huge as my face, but I'm gonna give it a bite. Mmm. I suppose if I got more chocolate chips and peanut butter in that bite, be good but I have so much sugar in my mouth from those last two bites one of the things about coming to voodoo donuts to this location is that you are downtown Portland downtown Portland there is a lot of diversity downtown and so you just have to be a little bit comfortable with that if you're gonna visit this location that's what makes it so amazing that voodoo donuts has so many locations in fact if you need it really washed up go to the one we saw in um, was it Orlando? Yes. And it was at Universal uh, Walk. So like the space between Universal Orlando and Islands of Adventure. They actually have a Voodoo Donuts there. If you see them, check them out. What you're supposed to do with a Voodoo doll, right? I can't imagine like somebody had a Voodoo doll of me and they bit my leg. Let's see here. Ah. <laughs> mm. Is that raspberry? It's actually pretty delicious, but oh my God, look at all of that stuff in there. So much sugar. Well, 
but we have one left I gotta try. Gotta balance out the protein. This is the classic. Yeah, I gotta get some protein in my diet, right? So this is their classic bacon, maple. It's so simple. I think that's actually the first donut I ever heard when I heard about this place years ago. And I was like, bacon and maple? Are you kidding me? Now, fast forward today. Like, oh my God, that's delicious. If this is the first time to our channel, let me kind of explain to you guys what Amy and I do. We travel all around the country nonstop. We're nomads. We live in our RV with our two cats and we go to different locations and we find places to eat and we report on the restaurant and or the food that's there. Now, are we professional uh, uh, food critics? Are we chefs? No, we're just regular average people, probably just like yourself, that are just curious as far as, do I want to eat there or not? Consider us like your friends. And we went and checked a place out and you're like, hey, was it any good? The kind of review you would expect for your friends is the kind of review that we're gonna give you on this channel. So what did we think of Voodoo Donuts? Of course we loved it. I mean, it's charming, it's unique. It's not just picking up donuts, it's an experience. If you see a Voodoo Donut while you're traveling somewhere, we highly recommend it. If you like this video, please, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, ring the bell because that will alert you when we have new content come out. And of course, always, always looking for comments. So tell us what you think of our video, give us some recommendations or just say hi, because we'd love to hear from you. And of course, we always encourage you to check out your local food bank or food shelter. They're always looking for donations of time, money, food donations, and not only does it help the people that live in your community, but it makes you feel good too. So until we dine together again, stay classy.